How significant is this, not only for India's space program, but India more broadly to be able to, you know, fingers crossed, successfully land on the moon? Uh, ISRO has uh, emerged as one of the major space uh, players globally, and uh, its services are available for uh, several countries, uh, including USA, Europe, and so on. Uh, now, this is uh, the ch today's mission, the Chandrayaan-3 landing on the lunar surface is going to be an important milestone as far as the Indian space program is concerned. So this is going to kickstart the process of the planetary exploration, which is very much on the agenda of the Indian space program. Uh, earlier in 2008, the first mission to moon, Chandrayaan-1, has uh, orbited around the moon and collected enough data about the surface features, mineral content, and also it was a unique opportunity to declare that there is uh, water in the southern polar region. So to validate this, uh, a craft has to land on the moon, collect samples, and return to the Earth. Uh, collect the samples, analyze, and send the data back to Earth. So this mission was uh, attempted uh, a few years back, but unfortunately, the last instant, about two kilometers above the surface, the mission landed in a catastrophe. Uh, now, yeah. since then, <coughs> ISRO has uh, done a lot of simulations and correct reactions, and this mission is uh, revalidating the technology for soft landing on the lunar surface. So this is All going right. to be an important milestone, uh, both technologically as well as scientifically. It will collect the local samples and confirm the data what has been collected in the Chandrayaan-1 and Chandrayaan-2 orbital missions.